Hello guys, this is EPN and 10 and welcome back to another Planet Sims Zombies Gotta Work for 2 video. Now today we'll be using a scientist, I believe. Yeah, this guy's level 8, so... Uh, let's use him. Uh, I, I have no idea what my upgrades are right now. But it should be ammo upgrade. Yeah, he only has like 5 ammo and then he gets 6. It's like, what? There's already a bunch of, uh, kernel coins here. I find this funny, like, last game, like, e e like always have, like, Ice Roses next to me. Like, I always have, like, the crappiest variants in my team. And then these guys have, they have the same thing every time. They have, like, a bunch of freaking, uh, BB Cocorns. Like, it's been happening, like, four games in a row now. I'm just waiting to see the Toxic P. Look at this guy. Yeah, there's the Toxic P. That's what we needed last game. Alright. We have party, uh, we have the party brains. All right, the good thing about this guy is that he could do damage from quite a distance. Like, plus it does damage over time. So technically, you're dealing like slightly over 20 damage per shot. Yeah, this is bad. This is really bad. There you go. You gotta get away from him. They always do that. Fortify damage is pretty sweet, but he doesn't get any. He doesn't get any damage upgrade. He gets some toxic upgrade. I don't think that's that amazing. Alright. Well, I'm gonna start healing players. I can't really go down there by myself. I'm going to get ripped to shreds by all the fire and toxic damage over time. They had exactly what we didn't have last game. Plus, they're summoning, like, a bunch of, uh, armored, armored plants. That's exactly what they need. Don't jump over me, bro. Alright, we have a mech. That's pretty nice. Let's just heal everything. He does, yeah, he does 45 damage. I don't know why his magazine size is so small. It was small in God of War for, uh, 1. It's still small in God of War for 2. I think he should at least have, like, 8 ammo. I don't think that's too much. Considering, like, you know, zoologists and chemists could have a much larger size and they're much more deadlier. Oh, what the heck? I meant to throw the ball. Yeah, you gotta get rid of the threats. There's always toxic peas coming in. Alright. Alright, they, if they all attack simultaneously, they're going to kick our butts. Period. I don't think we could keep this garden alive, though, for like three extra minutes. Yeah, look at that. They're, they're back. Okay. I expected him to have way more health. I'm just chilling over here. I mean, they have so many pea shooters. They're eventually going to capture because those relentless beam bombs are going to destroy us. Alright, there's a cur there's a corn strike. That's pretty sweet. Alright, there's another fire pea coming. Oh no! That war <laughs> This game does that sometimes, I don't know why. Oh boy, let's get out of here. It's not worth it. We we probably would have died. That's too much. You see, this is what, basically how you win the game is to spam the gardens with beam bombs and uh, uh, and butter barrages. That's the most effective way. Let's throw that down there. Wow, that was terrible. Let's go up here. I mean, I really don't mind if the garden lasts more than uh, more than the first one. I mean, you could probably stop them. I'm not sure. All right, let's actually heal down here. Okay. Alright, now we have a ton of super brains. That's awesome. We need something like that. Alright. If you get hit by that, we cannot use our abilities at all for like a good two seconds. They also do that with the tackle. I don't know why they did that. It's kind of a weird design decision. Oh, let's get out of here before we get killed. Alright, that's not that's not the uh, stuff here. That's awesome. It's not the bigger, better butter. Oh, let's get out of here. Now nah, we're dead. No, no, we survived with 1 HP. No, actually with 3 actually. That's awesome. Yeah, they're going to capture. It's gonna be a close capture though. Alright. All my teammates are... Uh, <laughs> they're all going in there. Alright, let's throw the heal ball over there. Uh, the heal ball does not, not, does not work on you if you're using the... Uh, 
if you're using uh, going back with this guy. He's, he's gonna rocket leap or whatever. Not rocket leap. Husk hop leap. He's gonna leap. Husk hop. There we go. Alright. There you go. But yeah, uh, the, the, the healing, the heal ball does not work if you're, uh, if, uh, if you're in, uh, the little barrel blast form or whatever it's called. The little barrel. It does not work at all. That's pretty interesting. Alright. Well, we have to run away now. And yeah, uh, sorry I haven't been uploading lately. It kind of sucks. But yeah, I'm back now, so it's all good. Don't worry about it. I, I haven't uploaded anything in like a week. <laughs> it's kind of funny. Actually, no, not really. But yeah, uh, basically, they said they're going to change scientists and they're going to buff Rose and Sunflower. So I would love to see how that works out. Uh, because yeah, that'll be interesting. I mean, Sunflower is like pretty... I, I always thought it was pretty good already, but if they're going to buffer, then yeah, it's going to be pretty deadly. On a, like a decent player. All right, let's see this guy. Let's shoot him in the left here. All right, there you go. You got to get rid of this guy. I can't go in there right now. I'll get wrecked. He shooting in turn mode. Yeah, this is pretty crazy. Let's not let's not be in the middle of the garden. I mean, it's pretty deadly. Like, if we're in the middle of the garden, all that's going to happen is, you know, beam bombs raining on our heads. That's all. Yeah, that's pretty much everything that's going to happen. Oh, dude, come on. All right, that's a teammate. That's good. To the back here. It's pretty nice at 45 damage, but it cannot kill Colonel Corn in three shots. If, if it did, like, 50, I think that'd be awesome. Like, if he, had, if he had a damage upgrade instead, and his damage went up to, like, 49 or something, that'd be amazing. Alright, everyone's healing here. This is a team now. This is a good team. We have a lot of scientists now. Looks like we actually got our crap together here. Oh, that's an ice peak. Let's get out of here. Yeah, he's over there chilling. Alright, I, th I think I saw a player. Yeah, I saw this thing behind us. Alright. What's up, scientist? Wow, he's running armor heal station. <laughs> Uh, I'm not to judge him though. I'm not to judge him. Don't worry about it. Yeah, paleontol. You barely see paleontologists anymore. It's kind of interesting. But as I said, you could like snipe with this guy. It's pretty. It's not. It's not that effective, but it's not terrible either. Like you're still dealing like you know the damage over time plus the initial damage. Oh boy, I can't really get rid of this guy. All right, we actually got him though, because my, uh, another team was shooting him. Yep, there's a bunch of Colonel Corns over there, and like pea shooters and all that good stuff. Yep, this is pretty uh, crazy stuff. And they're constantly in uh, terror mode up here. Yeah, I can't even hit him. That freaking tree is blocking everything. There we go. Yeah, it's over. We're going to have to stop him in the next one. This guard is not too hard. It's not too terribly hard. But yeah, if we had a lot of snipers, this, uh, this guard would be really hard to capture. But we don't. <laughs> Look at this guy. I'm uh, just following him. Oh, that's a nice rose. That's awesome. All right, good. Cause yeah, we need like uh, we need like players up there to like get any pea shooters. Cause yeah, once pea shooters are in rooftops and they just rain down on you, it's going to be a nightmare. That's like one of the most effective strategies to catch a gardens. I've done it before. Like I, I've literally captured gardens by myself as a toxic pea. This is, this has got to be the most obnoxious player. Is this ours? Yep, that is. Wow, that thing still survived. All right. Looks like it's, you know, it's still through the test of time. I think it's better to be aggressive and get rid of every uh, pea shooter. What's up, buddy? Get out of here. Let's go over here now. Yeah, as, as you see, this is pretty crazy. Uh, there's like constant, uh, there's constant stuff raining down on us. Let's revive more. Alright, I mean, we still got a minute left, a minute at 20, and the garden is like 7 eighths captured. So it's like, by the garden, I mean tombstone, alright guys? <laughs> a lot of people say, oh no, it's a, it's a, it's a tombstone, not a, not a garden. I'm like, uh, okay. I still call it like that, because I'm so used to Garden Warfare 1. Let's actually go up here, let's see what's up. Oh crap, let's get away from that. Looks like we're actually pushing them now, that's pretty nice. Oh, look at more pea shooters. But yeah, if, if we let them, like, in the back or whatever, we're pretty screwed. Alright, dude, I'll heal you. Alright. Got the heal as well. 
Wait, you have to take down the threats before they come here. Because if a pea shooter hypers and then he just goes into the garden and throws a beam bomb. He already threw it in the beat. He already threw it, so it's pretty much over. Right, at least we gotta get the revive bulls, right? Oh, we're dead. Yep, we're dead. We pushed too much. Why do I always see like Master Toxic P and Master Barbecue Corn? That's like I see like every time I get killed by a barbecue corn, like half the time they're all master rank. It's like what the heck? I understand why. I think it's because they're really easy to use. In my opinion, of course. Alright, what's up, that beard? Nice, we got him. Oh nice, we uh, reached level 10 with him. So yeah, that's pretty uh, that's pretty nice there. Uh, we actually won that game. Uh, that's actually pretty surprising. Plus, they had—I think they had a frost rose, so it's like, yeah, they ha they also had the teleporter up. The teleporter is pretty nice here. Definitely gets you a bit closer. All right, so yeah, to uh, Doctor Toxic there. Oh, is it Doctor Toxic? Yeah. There you have it. He did—he did, he didn't get a damage upgrade. That kind of sucks, but you know, uh, he does have like some toxic spread. I'm not sure if that's even good or not, but yeah. Yeah, with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. And we did not get the reviver uh, boss. What the heck? We revived. Oh, this guy revived nine. Holy crap. That guy, is, that guy isn't playing around. All right, let's actually uh, unbox this thing. Unpack, whatever you want to call it. Diamond. All right. Lucky Lantern. All right, that's a new one. Oh, yeah. So with that being said, thank you guys so much for watching. And I will catch you guys next time. Peace.